And welcome everyone on what is a perfect day for football here in South London. The venue is Selhurst Park. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary position is Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Crystal Palace facing Manchester City. Yeah, great to be here. How lucky are we, Derek? We get paid for this. Astonishing, really. Looking forward to a fabulous game. I'm sure the fans are too. Should be great. Number nine, Jordan Ayew. Number 20, Christian Benteke. And number 11, Wilfred Zaha. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. It looks like a conventional 4-4-2. A preferred formation by Arsene Wenger when he arrived at Arsenal. Two main strikers, four across the midfield. Really important for the fullbacks to link up with the wide midfielders in this system. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. Thank you, Selhurst Park. Enjoy the game. And the match begins. Ezzy. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. De Bruyne. It might be. Good defending to prevent the chance. Over it comes, and they deal with the threat this time. Gundogan, fine cross into the middle, and a no-nonsense clearance. Opportunity in the wide area. Chance to cross. And Anholt. Joao Cancelo. Foden. But it can't get all the way through. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Can he take the chance? There it is. And just the ideal start. Well, here's the goal again, and he's just been caught napping, hasn't he? Had his pocket picked, rightly punished, schoolboy stuff. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? So underway once more, Manchester, Manchester City, City with the advantage. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Jairo Riedewald. We're getting the ball forward. And return to Zaha. Laporte with the block.
Gundogan. De Bruyne now. Well, he's lost the ball. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Sloppy. He's in with a chance. It's got to be. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. A fine reading of the situation. Mares. The pass could do damage, but it can't get through. Now the pressure being exerted. And now he must score. Oh, wonder goal! Right out of the top drawer. Who could do better than that? Well, here it is. How do you like him? In an open goal, please. No goalkeeper, no defenders. Where were they all? Let's have another view of that goal. It's going their way, 2-0. Wilfried Zaha. Man City have hardly had the ball at all, but when they've had the ball, they keep delivering the sucker punch. A great advert for low possession, counter-attacking football. It's really working. And the counter-attack is on, options available. End product or not. He could pick out a teammate. And he clears the danger. Joao Cancelo. Rodri. Gabriel Jesus. Possession given away, unfortunately. Jairo Riedewald. Eberechi Ezi on the ball. And Riedewald has it. Is it going to be? And there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, he's gone for pure power, and why not when you've got a rocket in your boot? What a strike. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. So there we have it, 2-1. Goal for Crystal Palace. Number 20, Christian Benteke. Gundogan. On the offensive. Well, a good tackle. Might really be able to trouble them here. Ezi. Now with Van Aanholt. Eberechi Ezi on the ball. And a fine tackle. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here.
I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he's been decent. Unlike his teammates, he's done his job. And if everyone in the team just did their job, they'd be fine. A bit like me and you, Derek. Just go out and do your job. Well, advantage City after the first 45 minutes, but a long way from being decided. And a good-looking pass. Walker. The ball with Rodri. Good tackle. Really good interception. De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus. Precise ball movement. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Joao Cancelo. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Kuyate. Tremendous interception it was by Gundogan. Well, it could be on for him here. The net is staring him in the face. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here it is. A striker's bread and butter. Simple finish, but it's the positioning that gets him the goal. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, that's a tale of four goals in this match now. Three, one it is. We have Marley. Luka Milivojevic. Another perfect position to read it. Rodri. It's with Gundogan. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. A very good tackle. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Good-looking ball. There could be a chance now. And the flag does go up offside. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Well, as we can see from the stats, City controlling possession here. And what that does, it just relaxes the team. If you've got the ball, you enjoy the ball. And they're turning it into goals as well. Alert defending. Now, let's see what they can do here. Thou shalt not pass was the message delivered. Substitution for Crystal And Manchester Thomas. City will go to their bench. Number nine, Jordan Ayew. Coming onto the pitch, number 10, Andrews Townsend. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. A chance to whip it in. Rodri. 
Well, he did his job defensively. Sounds in. Well, the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Milivojevic. Good idea, that particular move, but not to be. Now can they counter clinically? Dangerous looking through ball. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. It is to be a throw-in. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Sterling. He has time to play it over. Aguero. And it's played into the centre. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Well, when he's in this sort of mood, he's absolutely unstoppable. What a performance. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And the timing to get this spot on, yes, it needs a bit of luck, but boy, does it need skill as well. It's a brilliant goal. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. 26, Leon Marmers. Ezzy. Only 10 minutes remaining here. Joao Cancelo. Aguero. And on the second half here, and it's almost Lee a case of whatever they've touched. And he's made headway. A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. Well, here it is. A striker's bread and butter. Simple finish, but it's the positioning that gets him the goal. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, enjoy the good days as a coach. It can be a roller coaster ride, I can tell you that. A glut of goals. 5 1 it is. Number seven, Raheem Sterling. Inside the final five minutes now. to catch it perfectly and didn't he just well here we can see Derek from this better angle it's all about the technique when you're volleying a ball it's all about timing let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection and there you go in the back of the net Bernardo Silva Sterling Aguero the ball with Rodri City move it forward with purpose keeping it moving dynamically and he's won the ball and the no-nonsense clearance Rodri Walker now. James MacArthur. 
Eberechi Ezi on the ball. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And that's sound goalkeeping. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Over it comes. It might be. What an absolute waste of a corner. And the referee blows for full time. It has gone awry for Crystal Palace and their supporters. No points for them, Lee. Well, Derek, they were out for today, and that's unforgivable. You don't mind being outplayed, and they surely were. But not to put up a fight, that's a scandal.